Hello, welcome back to our YouTube channel. I'm Andonia and I'm a first year medical student at FIPS. And this is essentially a week in my life. So what is first year? How has it been and how do you get in? I just want to make it clear I am a first year student. I'm speaking from my experiences and things I've noticed. Um, if you want specific information that is 100% accurate, please visit the university website and you should find everything there. So what is first year? First year is very much pre-med. It is the foundation, the building blocks to what is to come. We're not working in hospitals, we're not doing any clinical work, but we are learning a lot of the basic sciences, basic physiology and anatomy that is important for the coming years. We have six subjects at FITS, um, five per semester. There is physics, chemistry, APES, which is our introduction to medical sciences and just essentially biology. We have health system dynamics, which is just working with the systems overall and like the world is a system and we do some modeling with like dialysis and bioreactors, etc. It's quite a bit complicated to explain, but once you do the work, you actually understand it or try to understand it. And then we have psychology in first semester, which is a combination of health psychology, introduction to psychology, and also some philosophy of medicine. So it's a nice combination subject. And then that is swapped out for sociology with specific applications to the health sector in second semester. So it's nice to have those humanity subjects as well, just to balance out the sciences. This is for this specifically. Other universities obviously have different subjects but all first years are very much pre-med. So how do you get into med school? A lot of people ask me this and like I said, I'm only a student, so I can give you limited advice. I do recommend looking at the university websites for their specific requirements. But all I can say is just study hard and do well, do your best, because essentially in South Africa, they place a lot of focus on your academics for med school. You need to get good academic results for grade 11, for matric, as well as your METs. So really just study hard. And then also I often get asked is how do you push through first year? How do you have fun? How do you enjoy it? And okay, I'm not yet done with first year, but so far I really think that balance is what's got me through it. Making time for friends and family making time to do my hobbies, making time to exercise, as well as focusing on my academics whilst enjoying everything else is just the most important thing. Like I said, balance is key. If without balance, you really, I don't know, it's not enjoyable because otherwise you can burn out and just not have fun. And then the six years are gonna be very difficult, very, very difficult. So really just enjoy what you're doing, stay positive and have fun. And that's, that's how I've been approaching first year. And I think it's working out for me, so I'm quite happy, but yeah. So I just got home, 
I took a bit of a break and now I am starting my work. I have to do all my online work. So we have online lectures for some subjects like chemistry, have to get those done. Today was quite a nice day on campus. We spent some time on library lawns as well, speaking with some friends, just having a bit of fun between our lectures during our break. So that was lots of fun. And now I'm doing my lectures and then I got to study for tomorrow's test. So it's going to be a bit of a long night, but it it will go by quickly. So yeah. Hello, good morning. It is Tuesday morning. It is very early. It's literally like quarter past six. Um, yeah, I woke up about 20 minutes ago and I'm going to get dressed now and get ready because I've got labs this morning and then a chemistry test. So that's exciting. But anyways. So it is about 20 past 7 and I just got to campus. It's quite early um, but I do stay off campus so I do have to leave a bit earlier just to avoid traffic and get here on time for my 8 o'clock sessions. I have labs at 8 so I'll probably leave here in about 20 minutes just to walk up. I'm going to eat my breakfast and just chill a bit for the morning, maybe go over some chemistry because I'm also writing that right after. But yeah. I know what I was doing, I'm so tired, I overslept, I got here, people are running around, there's values everywhere, I'm just copying down, hoping it makes sense, it doesn't make sense. Um, this equipment, it's just, what is this, guys? First year medicine is a joke, um, I can't do this again, it's fine, let me go sleep, go home, but no. I just got home. It is currently sunset, as you can tell. It was quite a long day. My chemistry test did not go too badly. Good morning. It is currently quarter to seven in the morning and I am almost done getting ready for campus. I have to be on campus early again because I have APES labs. APES is our introduction to medical sciences, which is essentially our biology. It is quite relevant and I think the most relevant subject of first year because we do a lot of the systems and cells and medically related stuff. Today's lab is on urine analysis, which apparently is quite fun. There was a group that went last week. So we're going to be analysing urine samples with dipsticks and diagnosing them, if I'm not mistaken. That's what I understood from the pre-lab. So yeah, I am ready right now. I'm just busy packing some food for campus, busy warming up some food in the microwave for lunch. I'm going to take some breakfast to campus because I'm going to get there a bit earlier just to avoid traffic. So I'd rather eat breakfast in my car than right now. Um, so yeah. Now. Um. No, there's an extra. Oh. 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 Oh.
So I just got back from campus and it was relatively busy today. I had my urinalysis lab this morning and then once that finished I headed to the library to do an online physics tutorial. Then I had a physics lecture and then after that was a break and then a apes lecture or recap session. And once that finished I could only leave so I just got home and it's about half past four. And now I need to start working. We have a lot of assignments due this Friday. And yeah, so I'm going to get started with that. Good morning. It is about 20 to 7 and I'm running a little late because I have an 8 o'clock sociology lecture this morning. So I have to start heading to campus quickly. Um, Thursdays are also quite full. They have, we have 8 to quarter to 9, our first lecture, then 9 to quarter to 10. Then we have our tutorial at quarter past 10 till 11. Today I'm in the first session. If you're in the second session, you're from quarter past 11 till 12. So our mornings are quite packed with sociology. Um, then during the day, we have our physics lecture in person. And then we have chemistry lectures that we can do online and a medical science lecture, which we call AIDS, which is also going to be online for today. So I've got quite a bit of work today. And I'm writing a test tomorrow for system dynamics, so I'll have to study when I get home. But yeah, it's gonna, today's going to be hopefully fun. I just finished on main campus with all my lectures and tutorials. It is about quarter past three. I quickly changed into my physician society scrubs. Uh, shout out to Tank, thank you so much for the scrubs. And now I'm heading to med campus for an event. The physician society is hosting a screening of the documentary called Documentally. It is essentially a documentary that follows five doctors through their 30 hour call shifts. So it's going to be quite interesting, quite insightful and hopefully lots of fun. It's quite social. All my friends are going to go. Um, members of society are going to be there. So it's just going to be a really fun event. And then after the event, I will be heading home to study for my test I have tomorrow morning. That is an online test um, or practice. test. So we do modeling for system dynamics which is hopefully going to go really well, but I'm super excited for the documentary.
to keep high metabolic rates going, get oxygen to those tissues quickly. So I just got back home from campus. This morning was mostly online. I stayed at home. I did my HSD morning health system dynamics. It was just packed with a practice, with a tutorial, just finishing up some lecture stuff for that. And then I headed to campus to do our AIDS lecture recap session. And I came home now, did an online lecture, and now I'm just gonna go get ready and I'm going out for dinner with some friends. So Fridays are quite calm, which is nice. It's nice to have a calmer timetable on a Friday. And yeah, I'm excited for tonight. <laughs> we got fortune cookies. Yeah. Okay. Hectic. Your mind can make your body rich. Hey, my fortune. Please be good, okay? With integrity and consistency, your credits are piling up. Genius does what it must, but that talent does what it can. Wow. So thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed a week in my life or Monday to Friday. And I hope this video gave you some insight on what it's like to study medicine at FITS. Dude, I'll make one. <laughs> Take one, okay. Okay. What are you doing? Um, so today we're doing an AIDS lab uh, on urinalysis. Okay. And um, yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Sorry, God, we roll, we roll, we roll. I'm fantastic. I'm not okay. I need <laughs> sociology. <laughs> but it's fine. You need to you need to get those selfie cameras. Those cameras. <laughs> the lighting. The it's lighting. Really bad.